Hello everybody, cheeky lizard game here just before the World Cup. Um, funnily enough against Lizard against Dark Elves, so that's that's super interesting, isn't it? Um, yeah. So yeah, lizards saying up so that they can't run around and hit the uh, skinks. There you go. Hello Dimmy. Dimmy about to play his NAF Cup final. And, uh, and a half, so I thought I'd get one game of Blood Bowl in first. A bit of World Cup practice. Glorious. Oh, he's going to Dakar, is he? This looks sure looks like a Dakar defense, doesn't it? Dakar, Dakar, tactically defended. Oh, he's going for the four reroll build, going for the uh, not quite the PC build, but close to the PC build. I don't hate like the PC maximum agency build. Don't hate it at all. Wait, how has he got a reserve instead of an apple? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, because he's only got two re-rolls? Oh, yeah, he's got the rookie. He's got the rookie blitzer. Oh, I don't like this as much. Then. I have managed to not get a player served, so I've got better. Yeah, he probably is going to go towards the skink. I nearly, like, uh, made it imbalanced. To encourage him that way. I'd rather have went this way in terms of he's got bodges here, hasn't he? I'd rather not the bodges get involved.
I have defended attacker with elves before uh, versus Haymeyer in uh, SFL. The first time I defended it perfectly and won, and the second time I made a mistake, so lost. Which seems to be what happens when you face the Daka, right? One mistake just loses you the game. Music should have followed and jammed everybody in. You can actually surf that Saurus, can't you? <laughs> what a dumbass. Whether he'll try or not is a different question, but he probably has to. No, he's not. Well, he could still, I guess. Pile in. The only problem is the, the frenzy, right? But pile in is generally best, I think, versus soft teams.
I haven't got a clue what to do. I mean, he's got problems here, hasn't he? Yeah, you want to be, yeah, this is a very wide one, isn't it? I think so, Bucky, but who knows? Yeah, could have just dodged in and surfed the Vulcan, actually, yeah? That wouldn't have been such a bad idea, right? The uh, skink, just dodge in for the uphill. It's not bad at all, is it? One in nine? Yeah, do you know, do you know what? You're probably right there, cap notes. You're probably right. One in nine, dodge in, and then just a push. It's like, what, is it 55% or something? Is it 55 or 45? Is it 45? But do two chances at it. Honestly, the, the dodge in uphill surf is probably the correct play. Yeah, totally right. I didn't see it or consider it, but yeah, probably it was probably correct. Rolls a one instantly, good. Reroll burn. Instant reroll burn. How outrageous. Outrageous 1D pal. Good little move, to be fair. Interesting that he's not trying to stop the skink bullets, which is the obvious thing to do here, isn't it? So I can just go there. With both. And then this guy double G applies to both. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh, baby! <laughs> Fucking cars. You beautiful little shithead skink. Crocs ball! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Crocs ball, yes. Ah. Don't mind if I do. Fucking Crocs ball. <laughs> I mean, it was played for um, in terms of <laughs> um, putting it in there, you know, to make the scatter catches harder so they'd have a minus two. That's what it was in there for. And obviously strength five, so it's hard to deal with. Oh, the Dublo skulls. No. <laughs> only got two assists on it anyway, hasn't he? Can't get it. so you can only get a one D. Oh, probably next turn, punter. Probably next turn. I mean, there's not a lot else to do but mourn about dice in Blood Bowl. Hey! <laughs> Glorious skull. Literally next turn I'll complain about dice. Dodge there right at the end. Dodge being optional is tedious. Cheers. Hello, end it. Pretty good. Pretty good. Not gonna lie, this is a pretty successful defense. Ball on a Crocs. <laughs> <laughs> on opponent's drive. 
Two players surfed, one player cast. Ball in hand on a fucking Crocs. It's not the worst, is it? It's not the worst uh, result I've ever had. Fuck. There you go, next turn I get to complain about dice. No reroll. Uphill powers me, what a joke. If he powers me to here, I'm in two tackle zones. That's probably better, isn't it, to get powered? Wait, he's pushed me here, he can push me there. Oh no, okay. Mm. The final is uh, is on in an hour's time, yeah, very good. It is a little bit, yeah, isn't it, Timmy? Maybe I'm not a lizard. Maybe I'm not a dark elf coach. Maybe I'm a lizard coach. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Basically, sky truck, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the stupid thing, right? Like, it's really, it looks really bad on the stats because most people are bad at Blood Bowl, right? Like, not being nasty to anybody. But it's just a fact that most people aren't good, right? Or, or like most people are average, if you like. I mean, I guess most people are half the people are below average, right? Half of the people are statistically below average. But um, if I think if both players are good at Blood Bowl, I don't think it's that bad a matchup for the Lizards. I think it's like pretty 50-50. If both sides can play. Like even if the stats say it's worse than that. Oh, you horrible bastard. Look at this dice. He's got no re-rolls by the way. He's got no re-rolls. <laughs> no re-rolls, I hope you realise. Oh, I forgot I've got a Crocs. <laughs> I could just stand up the Crocs. I could have just stood up the Crocs on two players. Oh, well. Pick it up. Two. Move this to here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah.
Oh, that's a there's a player there. Dice, never lucky. <laughs> it's still annoyingly easy uh, hit on the ball, isn't it? But he doesn't have any rerolls. Only a push. Well, hey, only a push. Woo! Look at dog, Jimothy. I think the play is to make this skink dodge. To go into there and then blitz him to push this forward. And this out and then block him and then dodge once to score. Hmm. I don't think there's a way to fill this any other way than the uh, dodge. So if I push him there, and this one out, and then block this on two, then I need two assists over here to clear him. So that's these two assists. And on four, five, six, I've still got this assist, yeah. Motherfucker. I think I have to re-roll that, don't I? I should have made this block first. So I would have had to have re-rolled it. say I blocked my path. I blocked my path, didn't I? I fucking blocked my path. Literally, I could should have assisted. No, could I? I maybe I couldn't have assisted anyone else because of him. No, oh, maybe I couldn't have assisted anyone else. Oh, I'm a dumbass. Two dodges. I'm a dumbass.
<laughs> the extra dodge kills me, of course it fucking does. Jesus Christ, maybe there was a way of doing that that was cleverer than not thinking at all. If I'd anticipated the second dodge, then maybe that could have worked around it, but I didn't even think of it. I thought it was just straight through. I thought it was just straight through, but um, maybe there was a better play. I'll block the block witch first. That doesn't mean anything to me, Chicken. <laughs> I was just going to move them both on the side. I, I thought I could just move them both to the side. I didn't see that he blocked me moving the skink the saurus around. So I just, I just did. Like if I'd seen that, I might have worked out what the hell you're talking about. But <laughs> unfortunately, it was a. Uh, you know, I, it's ages ago that I thought about it, and I've already forgotten all about it. <laughs> so, <coughs> unfortunately, Jigen, your sentence means nothing to me. The new rules, yeah, you mean the, the stupid Euroball rules that surely can't happen because they're idiotic. Um... I have not and will not play with those rules. Yeah, I just can't, I can't, like, I can't go back in time and think of it, Jigen. I just literally thought, my two Saurus, I thought were going to go either side, and then when I meant to move the second, I was like, shit, oh, there's a tackle zone there, I can't do it. So if I'd so seen that earlier, maybe I'd have seen a different, like, I'd have looked for a different chain push, right? Because I was thinking it was just one dodge. So I would have looked for something else if I had, uh, if I had seen that. The Euro Bowl, I mean, the Euro Bowl, the rules are a joke. So I'm going to ignore them until until they're not a joke. <laughs> I think is the best way to think about them. These are the these are the Blood Bowl three World Cup. That's why we've got six lizards. I could just go up here, couldn't I? It's alright. I could look at the replay and then knowing that I wasn't going to be able to move around for the assist. So I was going to block myself with the assist. Because I just did the blitz to save me a GFI, right? So I could have done that block first. And see if I got the POW. And if I didn't get the POW, then I use the blitz and then just do a GFI. Hmm. I mean, it was still unlucky, wasn't it?
Mm -hmm. I've somehow run out of players. No problem. I just wanted a bang, bro. I forgot this one had been stunned. Dimbo! I should, of course, maintain complete uh, impar impartiality in casting. <laughs> Dead. Diced. Jesus. Oh, I kept him in contact with my skin. That was a bit stupid, wasn't it? Funny about that. Oh my god, the Norwegian here, yeah, that was amazing. Maggie Thatcher! <laughs> Maggie Thatcher! Your boys took one hell of a beating! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably the greatest commentary of all time, isn't it? Realistically. Is he going to foul here? It looks like he's going to foul. 
Doesn't make a lot of sense with down to nine players, does it? But Honestly, that's enough action for the turn. Let's punch him. I was thinking of putting him there, but then he can get surfed, right? And I don't want to give him the chance to get to surf me. Push him behind the ball. You can technically surf this. It takes in a lot of players. But like... It's not even... Difficult. So I can't let him do it. Maybe I should have just done the Crocs block first and then pushed him out and then he could have blitzed that as a way to stand up. But I thought, you know, pushing the Witch Elf into there, into there was pretty good, right? Six dice on the Witch Elf, armor seven. If I power it early, I could have moved up the side. Too dangerous to cage anywhere near her with having jump up. Maybe I should have stood up the crocs just to protect the Soros just to protect the crocs here. Eh? Because now he's going to bang out the crocs, maybe. Maybe not. He's basing things. <laughs> We're going for the old face to fist technique. It's not what I'd do, but who can say if it's good or bad? him with him and then just don't move the crocs but um I could also move a skink around and then blitz him but it only frees up the other skink anyway and I can just dodge that skink so it's greedier to activate the crocs isn't it but this is safer
Smash through here, please. Not great, is it? Let's try and get the crocs in here. Motherfucker. Maybe I shouldn't have done that, he was a bit greedy, wasn't he? I could have just kept the crocs there. The crocs was in a fine square, really. Got a bad case of the uh, lack of turn four panic here. <laughs> really should have tried to go somewhere at some point, but didn't. A full pal. 
I kind of need a full power now. Shocking. A full pow? So just double GFI with him, double GFI with him. I'm down for four GFIs. Easy, never in doubt. No, oh, do you know what? I should have gone out the back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then he couldn't have gotten any anywhere. Yeah, that's where I should have gone. Like, uh, ideally, I could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Maybe I should have tried those anyway, right? They might have all worked. He's not really doing anything. He kind of does something, right? He makes a screen with him to stop these through coming. Maybe it's not terrible. Maybe he should have just gone here, though. Do you know what? I put this guy in the wrong square, didn't I? I've just realised this could have just been here, couldn't it? Because the crocs has given minus one there, so and if it had been there, you'd have had to come in the front for worse, worse pushes and scatters and stuff. What did he roll in the dodge in? Roll the six anyway. Man, I sure feel like I've been diced this game. <laughs> Despite the Crocs scatter catch. This is a brilliant art. Lord Salakis. Oh yeah, he had to have yeah, there's nothing else to do with it. But yeah, I, I should have put the skink here. That skink was definitely yeah. on the square. And I should have tried those extra dodges at the end. Even though I re-roll. 
But then I guess at least I've got a skink here, haven't I? Which is which is not nothing. No, he's, he's not got no scoring threats. Oh no, he does. Huh. Christ, I couldn't have done much more, could I? Eight dice on the ball. <laughs> Fucking dub scored. <sighs> Comedy mega. Of course, there's the power in the cars. But, I mean, this is exactly what I don't like about lizards, right? At the end of the day, there were some like three plus rolls that failed that were critical. Um, that's always going to happen, isn't it? Like, elves are always going to be able to 2D the ball with like some dice. So, this is what's wrong with lizards. But they're really, really good, even in like a bad matchup. They're still really strong. They're a monster team. Plus, they're pretty cool as well, aren't they? Lizards and skinks and crocs. I could, I could have a lizard man team. Oh, the Games Workshop ones all fucking people standing on their fucking tiptoes, aren't they? Which is pretty shit. It's no good failing now. <laughs> I need you to fail earlier. Oh, that 
was all right, wasn't it? it? Showed how good lizards were. Like it was so close to it. That was really close to a two 0 win, right? So um, yeah, lizards are very good. Lizards are very very good. Um, right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.